Number Talks, a math game changer. If you're like us, you've heard of Number Talks over and over again, and are even being asked to use them in your classroom. You might be thinking, as we did, why? Do I really need to add something to my already jam-packed day? Will they truly make a difference? And what exactly are Number Talks, and how would I go about implementing them? Well, Number Talks are magical. They really are. There are so many benefits to using them. Number Talks build number sense and computational fluency throughout the year. They fill in the gaps of a typical math program by consistently challenging students to solve computation problems, not just focusing on them a couple units during the year. Number Talks also help students become flexible and efficient math thinkers. Instead of memorizing rules and procedures, they manipulate numbers and use strategies that make sense to them. Number Talks increase students' mathematical reasoning skills. In fact, students explaining and justifying their thinking is at the heart of Number Talks. In addition, Number Talks build a strong, safe learning community. Number Talks are short daily math exercises. They should only take between 5 and 15 minutes. They are a perfect warm up before teaching your core math lesson. Number Talks are typically mental math activities that help students develop computational skills. They can look many different ways. Students may be asked how many dots there are and how they know, or use multiple numbers to reach a specific amount, or even solve strings of equations that are related to one another. Number Talks are open-ended problems that get kids thinking, either by having more than one possible answer, such as balance the scale, where students figure out different ways to make each side of the scale equal, or by being able to solve the problem using a variety of strategies, such as target number. You can see that Jackie used her fingers to show 10 and then added up two more. Selma used the double seven plus seven is 14, then subtracted two. Students see that problems can be solved in different ways and they love the challenge. Number Talks are student-led conversations that enable students to learn from one another. Here's an example for make a 10 or not. For seven plus four, Jen said she would make a 10. Seven and three is 10, so one more is 11. Carlos agreed, saying that he can see how she broke the four into three and one in order to make the 10. Todd shared that instead of making a 10, you can add up, but he had a stuck point. Peggy helped him out by asking if it made sense and by sharing how she would add up. Todd decided to try it again. To teach a number talk lesson, first present the problem to your students. Next, give students time to solve the problem independently. When they have an answer, have them put a thumb up against their chest. To keep early finishers thinking, have them put a finger up for each additional answer they come up with. Third, partners share their answers and how they figure them out. If they disagree, they ask questions and explain their thinking. When they are finished sharing, they put a fist up to their chest to let you know they're done. Next, call on a student to share his or her answer and their justification for it with the class. As students listen, they make a me too signal if they agree or if they solved it the same way. If they have something to add or if they disagree, they put up a pinky. They discuss until a consensus is reached. As students share, record their thinking and the strategies they use. And that's it, a number talk lesson in a nutshell. Here are some helpful tips to take away. Have a daily number talk if possible, but at least three times a week is good. Keep the number talk short, between 5 to 15 minutes. Give students think time so all have a chance to process the problem. Accept all strategies. This allows students to enter the task at their own level. A variety of number talk activities will keep students engaged. Ask questions. Don't just tell them. You want them to think their way through.